How to record desktop audio in OBS using Soundflower on a Mac. Dependencies. Install OBS first and install Soundflower. That's pretty straightforward. Leave everything as default and then follow the instructions in this video. I've already done that. I've already installed OBS and, Sound, and, and Soundflower. I'm just going to show you that. So there's OBS and it's running now and I'm just recording this video using it. Soundflower uh, is, is in my uh, finder. It's already been installed and there it is there, Soundflower. But I won't use that right now. First, I'll demonstrate my problem is that I can't record the, uh, the desktop in OBS. So OBS is now visible. Um, I, I can minimize that. I've got this video here that I prepared earlier. And it's flashing colors, but it's also random musical notes. And you can't hear that. So you can't actually see it on there. So I want to record the audio in OBS. So I'll go to settings and I go to desktop audio device um, and I'll see a thing called Soundflower because it's now installed. Now the desktop audio levels are still not showing any audio there. So what I need to do is open up Soundflower, and there it is. And then you get a little icon at the top here, and you need to select built-in output on Soundflower 2 channel. Built-in output. Now we can see that we still don't get desktop audio there. So we have to do one more thing. We go to uh, System Preferences, open up Sound, and we select for the output, we select Soundflower 2. And now, we get Desktop Audio. I put it back on headphones, we don't get anything. We put it on Soundflower 2.